Hi Tiger fans, happy International Women's Day. Um, I'm just here to go and chat to some of the VFLW girls, get a bit of insight and a bit of juicy gossip out there, so I hope you enjoy it. Let's go. <laughs> Shy, do you mind just um, standing up for us? Not that it's much of a difference. There we go, Kim's coming. Now Shy, can you give us any um, pros or cons being the shortest in the competition? What do you reckon? Uh, yeah, look, pros don't have to bend as far down as good old Alice over here. <laughs> Cons, shit out, Mark. I mean, for sure. <laughs> Evie, Evie, hello, Evie. Last year, you somehow had the best goal celebration. Can you just give us a, bit of a demo of your goal celebration last year? It was actually, but... a no goal. A no goal. Yeah. All right. Can you have a bit team. of a run up if you want? <laughs> <laughs> that was it. And I'm Tragic. really looking forward to breaking it out again this year. Yeah, good. We can't wait. Now, um, as we're all aware, round six we have in Northern Territory this year, don't we? Yeah. Up in NT. It's a bit hot up there. So how's um, how's the pale skin going to go up there, Grace? Um, I believe uh, sunscreen's going to sponsor the, sponsor me this year. So I'm looking forward to being pale when I come back as well. And not, not too bad. Not too bad. No, nah, not too bad. Okay, good. Love yeah, that. Love thanks. it. Thank you. State of the art facilities, what would be your favourite, favourite part about these facilities? Oh yeah, the bathroom obviously, um, the, the hair dryers, um, the, the, you know, the QV body wash, yeah, those are on point because I've got a lot of allergies, you know, so the QV body wash definitely a uh, bonus, so yeah. yeah. We've got QV body wash, it's a win. Can you just tell us what your favourite coffee in Melbourne is and where you get it from and how much it is? Well, uh, I'd have to say uh, not only favourite coffee, but uh, favourite shop ever is 7-Eleven. <laughs> it's only one dollar and sometimes I seek an extra short life in there. So. With your, how much you're saving on your one dollar coffee? A dollar a day. A dollar a day. Can, if everyone buys their one dollar coffee, can they all put in for our new women's membership? Oh, 100%. You can buy two, three. <laughs> Seriously. Exactly. Family pack. Huh? Family pack, correct. Right, great. We love that. Loz. <laughs> Loz. Hello, Loz. How are we? <laughs> no, Loz. Don't run away. Don't run away. Come on. We've lost Loz. <laughs> We've lost one. That's all right. We can get another one. So I'm back. But one day when I was like 16 years old, <laughs> no, I went to the first AFL game um, against Collingwood and, um, and Loz was on the side and I went and got her autograph and a picture with her and now I'm living with her. <laughs> so not every day you get to live with the heroes. I'm true. <laughs> so Abby, you don't mind if we just interrupt you for a second here. How's it feel to be on the other side of the uh, interview interview station here? Much better, yeah, to be yeah, honest. Really yeah, good. less pressure. How are you feeling about yeah. it? <laughs> I'm a bit shaky. Um, any um, words to the fans out there? Firstly, they're on Tigerland. So any International Women's Day this weekend? Any big words? Or? Yeah, no, look, it's a very exciting place to be here at the Richmond Footy Club. Um, obviously, coming in AFLW next year. So I guess everything's kind of preparation for that. So it's a really exciting time and a very exciting place to be. Awesome. We're glad to have you along. <laughs> Great interview. Yeah. Seems like I've scared everyone off, so we better hit the track. But um, thanks for watching, guys. Have a great weekend. And um, till next time, grow the tigers. <laughs>